Well, this year is the 100th anniversary of the start of World War I, and we will be celebrating the activities of the armed forces in that, in, at that period. And this year we will be featuring the State Band of the Royal Regiment of Scotland, the Ceremonial Band from the Polish Army, the Band of the Armed Forces of Belarus, an Austrian military band, and many other groups and participants will be taking part to conclude in a grand finale in a commemoration of World War I. Well, the other displays include the field gun, which is the uh, a competition between three armed forces, the Army, the Navy and the Air Force. And then we also have this year, for the very first time, the Royal British Legion Riders Association, uh, who will be performing with in excess of 100 motorcycles and a display for the Royal British Legion. Well, the ever popular uh, items within the tattoo are obviously Royal Air Force Cos for Queen's Colour. Uh, it's a celebration with bringing on the Queen's Colour, which is a very rare uh, opportunity for them to display it. Uh, they also, RF Cos, will take part in the field gun against the Army and the Royal Navy. We're delighted that uh, the Birmingham Tattoo is always able to produce a large array of standards from all over the country. In fact, we, last year I think we had about 140 standards parading on the 25th anniversary of the tattoo, and this year we hope to do, improve on that. It's always very important to include items which would be of interest to all the family, uh, whatever age. And so with that in mind, apart from the, the regular military bands from around, around the world, we also include youth groups uh, from within the UK. Uh, we have a, a large dance uh, contingent and uh, we have a number of other youth groups taking part, cadet groups, army cadets, navy cadets, marine cadets, and uh, it's it all in mind to create a family entertainment. Our aim is to provide a three hour show of spectacular entertainment for all the family. It's at the end of November, 29th and uh, 30th of November at the National Indoor Arena and it will conclude with a grand finale, a tribute to all the people that took part in World War One. And we have all the mass bands on parade. We have well over a thousand people taking part in the finale. Fine singers taking part, well known throughout the world. And we hope to see you there.